Hello, I'm going to take you through Axiom's token system so you can see how we can pass data between steps. Tokens are the name we use for data or variables that get moved between steps as inputs or outputs. In this example, we have a bot that will go to this listing page and get the top three links. It will then visit each link and take a small amount of data from each page and then write this data to a Google Sheet at the end. To build this bot, we first use a step called get a list of links from pages. And in this case, we've set it to three results maximum. The links create a token called scraped link data that you can see highlighted with this yellow plug. In the subsequent step, loop through data, we can feed in this data to the loop the data is called scrape link data. On the step, go to page. We can tell the bot to visit the links. To do this, we click insert data, and then we choose the links, which is column A from step one, i.e. the first bit of data that we got on each row, which is the link. After scraping the data from each page, we now get a new token called all interaction data. This token encompasses all the data that we might scrape in multiple steps within this loop. Within the final step, we can choose to write all interaction data to the Google Sheet. This appears as a drop down in the data step. In summary, Axiom steps pass data between one another via tokens which are named things like scrape link data or all interaction data and similar. They're highlighted with yellow plugs. You can feed them as inputs to other steps and they produce their own outputs as a result of other actions.